if you are not big on acai or if you love coconut, if you love pitaya, whatever it is, ice cream, go get yourself some right now because we're gonna make a smoothie bowl. So I've been into acai. Acai is not, I don't know if it exactly counts as a smoothie bowl, but it's kind of like the idea. And I got these from Costco last time. And two days ago, I made the first one ever from like this packet because it is the first time I ever have bought in this because I am not a huge fan of acai, which you might think it's weird that I bought this because of that. But one time I tried acai with Nutella and it was over for me. Like I fell in love with that. I think that... When it's the coconut base, I can eat it like that without the Nutella, but, but when it is the acai, I need to have Nutella on it because it just makes it taste better. Acai with Nutella, if you haven't tried it, try it because it's so good. And I already have a packet because like I said, last time I made one for the first time, and I ended up using both of them and little did I know that two of these is a lot. So this time I'm only gonna put one because I'm also gonna put toppings and I'm gonna show you the toppings that I have right now. I got a bowl here that I'm gonna be using and I'm using like these wood ones because aesthetic, you know? I like these better. And I also have fruit here. I got blueberry and raspberries i literally went to market last night and looked at the strawberries and i was like i'm not getting any of these they all looked really really bad like i just felt like they were gonna go bad soon so i was like yeah that's not happening and bananas actually something i usually add to but the market that i went to it wasn't like you can break some off and then have some good ones and then have some that would not be ready for a while so mine's basically aren't ready yet so i'm not going to be using them and i am going to go ahead and rip off this packet and i think it's pretty good to go so i'm going to go ahead and put it in the bowl i'm not sure if i let it melt too much like was i not supposed to have it this much i don't know if this is weird but it's starting to look like a lot less than it was before so I might actually put the two packets. Maybe I'm gonna put one that's thought out and one that's not thought out. There you go. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna try to like smash it down a little bit. And I forgot to mention, I currently have some coconut toasting in the oven and then I also got this. I was at Trader Joe's, so, you know, they don't have Nutella. This is the closest thing that they have to Nutella, which is this cocoa almond spread. And, oh my god, it's not even... Nothing's happening here. I need something stronger. Oh, I'm making a mess. <laughs> supposed to this is how you know I don't really make a sign this thing is rock hard but you know what I'm gonna just let it be because I'm pretty sure it's gonna melt a little bit at least once I put the coconut if you didn't already I am a big shopaholic and once this video goes up, it's technically going to be yesterday, that's Prime Day, and I'm going to show you what I have in my cart and what I'm going to add to my cart too. So I have the Nutella thing here, and I grabbed like a Ziploc with the wide mouth cup and opened it up because I'm extra and I want it to be like a drizzle on it. And I'm going to go ahead and check on those coconut flakes. Alright, so I have the toasted coconut here. And I'm gonna go ahead and put it on top of the fruit. Uh, 
and I love a lot of it, so I'm gonna go heavy with it. Okay, and then now I'm gonna drizzle that Nutella on top, and I'm actually gonna get you guys closer for this one. I can't believe what just happened. I literally thought I was recording and I didn't even record when I drizzled the Nutella on top, but I did. And now I'm gonna go ahead and try it. Ooh, it's still like a little hard. Let's see. Mmm. Literally, so, so good. Anyways, I am going to start showing you guys some things. Anyways, I'm going to start showing you guys some things that I really want to buy. I'm obsessed with these workout leggings. I own two of them. One in like a navy blue, which is this one. And another one in a black which is this one right here. And I feel like the way it shapes your body, it just looks so good. And I found out that they have sports bras and I'm just like, I kind of want to get sets, you know? I'm kind of really hating when I have workout leggings and I don't have a sports bra for it because then I have to try to match it and i feel like it's hard if it's not like a black color or like a gray color it's really really hard to match them either like black gray or white those are easier to match like with any color leggings but if the leggings are a different color it's a little hard so i was thinking of getting this red set right here so here's the top and then the leggings. Thinking about getting this gray color here, which this is a sports bra, this is the leggings. It's supposed to be in volcano gray for the sports bra. And then the leggings are as asphalt gray. And then I was maybe thinking of brown, but to be honest with you, I didn't see one that matches like exact. This is the closest that I got. This is a sports bra and this is the leggings and then i was thinking maybe just maybe i may get an orange one i'm not sure yet because i like orange but i am very particular about what i get in orange like i have tops that are orange but i've never had workout sets that were orange and that is gonna be it for this video i hope you all enjoyed remember to like comment share and subscribe and if you haven't already check out my description down below i have my boyfriend's channel link i have the channel that i have with him linked down there as well and i also have my amazon page down there if you do want to check it out and see what i recommend on buying definitely definitely click on that link but i will see all you beautiful people in the next one bye